our RFID reader is connected to the microcontroller and at the same time that uh, LCD display is also connected to the microcontroller and I have connected these uh, three LEDs and one budger. Now today uh, I will be showing you here how the RFID reads the tag and how the result comes out. So I have some tags. So this is also a tag. This is also a tag. And this is my uh, credit card. This is also my credit card. Okay. And this is uh, some card. So they have, uh, they, you know, wherever Wi-Fi connection is there, there will be one uid tag and the rfid can read that uid and uh, with this help of the uh, rfid reader we can make a lot of projects so i have written the code here as per my coding i want to show you here yeah so i have written the code here for different leds different pin i have set here and i have written the, the what pin more uh, green led red led budget all the things and what the display will be showing i have written here scan your card now scan your card is written here similarly so if i take one tag so i have the tag id here if i take congratulation will come will be displayed and different things i have written here and the code i have shared here in the description so in the description i have given all the uh, connection system and the uh, code i have written here you can copy and you can put and your project will be ready so let me show you now this is one tag i have written the code i want to show you here where is my code so now this one is showing scan your card yes here uh, the display is showing scan your card now i will take this tag i have written this tag number now it will show congratulations now look here and the bulb yeah you can see the budget gives and congratulations one second congratulations and i have written orange light uh, for this uh, this uid tag one second congratulations now i want to take this blue tag blue tag for blue tag i have written different code access granted yes access granted i hope it is visible to you yeah so once again access granted green led and this one congratulations different led congratulations and different led now i want to use my credit card access denied red led and different thing one second congratulations tag access denied yeah so this is our project on rfid so now i will connect with uh, server motor and i will use this one for door lock and door unlock system welcome to the coding session so today in this session we will be discussing more detail about uh, rfid connection with uh, lcd budget and the server motor how it is uh, used uh, for uh, different projects especially door lock unlock atm card and many more things so if i tell you about lcd you can use LCD directly with these pins and I have given in the description here if you click my description you will find all the detail with code because it is connected to my github so you will find all the connection what pin you will be using everything I have mentioned here so that you can do it easily so this LCD directly you can use with the pins or you can use one inner integrated circuit so this one we are using to minimize the pins because here you will find 16 pins but sometimes in our microcontroller so we may not have sufficient pins to connect so in order to minimize the pins and minimize the space so i have used this one integrated inner integrated circuit right so an inner integrated circuit is a serial bus connection serial connection so it is connected in such a way that it, it will minimize the pins and i have connected here and you know rfid it has eight pins but we connect only seven pins to different pins of the microcontroller i have mentioned here similarly led budget and this lcd okay after all this connection now we'll go to the arduino ide so if i go to arduino ide i have written the code here and the same code i have given here if you go to code you can get the code one for only with lcd another code for both budget and lcd i have given so you can use the code and you can find out i have given everything in the description so that you can do it easily at your home so you know this project is very helpful for high school students because here one positive effect is there we are using c++ code the basic of c++ code and here you can use the code and you can see the result i mean you can see the output so that it will be more interest for high school students to learn the code easily because otherwise if i go to python if i go to directly c++ sometimes uh, we have to write only code but here this uh, Arduino 
Arduino uh, IDE uh, gives us one interesting that we can connect and we can see the output of the uh, coding. All right, so let me connect. 